The pupil is the dark circular opening in the center of the iris and is where light enters the eye. The pupillary light reflex or photopupillary reflex is a reflex that adjusts the diameter of the pupil in response to the intensity, or brightness, of light by falling on the retinal ganglion cells in the back of the eye, assisting an eyesight ability to adapt to different levels of lightness or darkness. A higher light intensity causes the pupil to constrict therefore allowing less light in, whereas a lower light intensity leads the pupil to widen thereby allowing more light in the scara. Thus, the pupillary light reflex controls the amount of light that enters the eye. It may be helpful to consider the pupillary reflex as an iris reflex, as the iris sphincter and dilator muscles are what can be seen responding to ambient light. The pupillary light reflex is a useful diagnostic tool for assessing the integrity of the eye's sensory and motor processes. To measure brain stem function, emergency physicians often test the pupillary light reflex. Optic nerve injury, oculomotor nerve damage, brain stem lesion, including brain stem death, and depressive medicines such as barbiturates can all cause abnormal pupillary reflexes. Now, the pupillary reflex is conceptually linked to the side, either left or right, of the reacting pupil, and not to the side from which light stimulation originates. Left pupillary reflex refers to the response of the left pupil to light, regardless of which eye is exposed to a light source. Right pupillary reflex means the reaction of the right pupil, whether light is shown into the left eye, right eye, or both eyes. Remember, when light is shown into only one eye and not the other, it is normal for both pupils to constrict simultaneously.